The Egea region is situated in the western part of Slovenia. The region is renowned for its unspoiled natural environment, where the picturesque town of Idria, the oldest mercury mining town of Slovenia, is located. The town of Idria maintains a strong link with its 500 years old mining tradition. The town is dotted with numerous landmarks linked to its rich mining past. The most visible being the 16th century Gevok Genek Castle. It houses Idria's Mining Museum, awarded the Best European Museum of Technical and Industrial Heritage in 1997. The waterwheel Kamscht, one of the biggest wooden wheels in Europe used for pumping water from the mercury mine, can be admired in the vicinity of the Mining Museum. Pogonsko kolo je obnovljeno, da pokaže obiskovalcem, turistom, ne, en del tele mogočne in pomembne tehniške dediščine rudnika živega srebra Idrija. Numerous guided tours bring to life the local technical heritage. The tour of Anthony's shaft provides a unique walk inside the mercury mine. Clothed in special green-black jackets and equipped with helmets, the tourists descend directly into the mysterious underworld. I live today here in Idria and in the Antonio Ro. En het is denk ik echt de moeite waard. Het is echt iets wat je niet overal ziet. Het is anderhalf uur loopje en het is echt schitterend. A stone throw away from the mercury mine, the miner's housewives prepare the Idria's most famous culinary speciality, the Idrischki Zlikofi, the secret recipe transmitted from generation to generation. Well, I was thrilled actually because um, I, I've heard of that pasta before and don't ask me to pronounce the name. I'd read it in the guidebooks and so it was just wonderful. I felt it was very special to be able to go and see it being made and the women were just so friendly and uh, I liked their costumes. The Idria Lace. The lace products bearing the name Idria Lace are made of natural materials using traditional techniques connected with the local rich lace heritage. The early days of lace making in Slovenia can be traced back to the 16th century and the tradition is still very much alive today. The unique lace patterns draw inspiration from the Idria's lush natural surrounding. Here, tourists can enjoy educational hiking tours along the well-kept and meditative tracks at the Zgornia Idrica Regional Park. Ponudba od Idrijske regije je zelo pestra, imaš različne možnosti, različnih krajev za kolesarjenje, pohodi, ogledal narave, res neokarjene narave. S veseljem priporočam vsem, da se ogledajo teve lepe kraje, kar jaz bi se z veseljem vrnil še enkrat. Untouched nature and a rich cultural and technical heritage make Idria a unique tourist destination to be experienced over and over again.